Conscious thinkers, welcome back to the God Vibration. Let's tap in. Um, let's get some shaman messages, okay? Beloved, radical acceptance number two. whale song resonating i can see the crossing initiation as well so we have this strong fire energy and we have this strong water energy this is that yin and yang This is karmic balance. All right, so let's tap in. Let's see. You're learning how to speak your truth more clearly in your life at this time. There could be a lot that's going on that, uh, you're not a part of and there's a lot that's going on that you are a part of that you are the creator of right but you're learning how to balance the have and the have not there's something about cooling energy I don't know exactly what it is that I'm tapping into but there's something about cooling energy <laughs> dust devil movement out of stagnation number 15 and number 31 in the hand the universe is your partner this feels like a very free energy that I'm tapping into. Free as in very, this is a very valuable resource, but free in terms of spiritually. like that flame right you hold the power to the flame because you are the cooling energy This is a move. This could have been something, this could be a past energy, something that may have been disruptive, chaotic. Um, I don't know, but there's a lot of activity, right? You've been moved out of this. Again, you know, I always say that's you, you moved through this energy. And it actually did created this. This is what was left behind the dust. So what's happening now? This is a movement forward. 
unmarked trail revelation this is your awareness of this you're moving you could be moving jobs you could be moving homes you could be moving um cities okay but this is a beautiful change that's happening in your life It's like a brand new start for you. To be settled, settled, settlement. You're receiving a settlement. You found a space within your life that you're ready to settle down. God is going to place this in your life in a way that's very personal. You'll know how to receive it. You're receiving a settlement. Some of you could have been in court. Um, this has been like the final hearing of a case. This could have been something that was ongoing for a very long time, but you have finally come to a completion of this. Your funds are coming in. Um, and also movement again this movement out of stagnation right behind this wow i thought we had i thought mindful was underneath this oh there it is but i was going to say behind the dust devil movement out of stagnation was that movement from the mindfulness right was that movement from the yeah mindful the group think whatever could have been maybe causing an imbalance within your emotional space because this fire can be emotional right but again that yin and that yang this is about self-mastery so you've gone beyond a certain space in your life it's kind of like okay let me give you an example let's say you go to school and you pass the first grade straight through to the sixth grade. And then instead of going into seventh grade, right? You go back to first grade and then you go through first grade to sixth grade again. And then instead of going into seventh grade, you go back to first. That energy has been fossilized. You are no longer allowed to go back into those spaces. The divine has barred you from those spaces. So to go against that would be to go against yourself at this point, right? You're within an energy, you're within a mind frame, you're within a time in your life where you are meant to move into this new space and that requires you to fully do so. See, because you've spent your time trying to heal a certain space and you've understood the space. And so it's like, now that you've learned certain 
spaces, energies, lessons, places, environments, all of these things, right? That was hurtful, um, happy, exciting, uh, you know, challenging, all of these things. It, it, it's been a lot. Sometimes it was really bad and sometimes it was really good and sometimes you could cry about it and sometimes you could laugh about it and you've served that time and it's now for you to accept the knowledge that the divine has given you about people, about places, about things, about all of this that you have been a part of in your life. You have gotten the answers. The divine is moving you into a new space. Because you are ready. To stay behind, you'll just get bored now. And it'll become unfair. And you'll start to waste your energy. You have the gift of foresight. Don't waste that. There are persons who you were connected to who have lost their gifts. Not fully, but If they continue on the path that they're on, I don't know. That's not for you to stay and suffer with. It's your time to live. These are your spirit messages, y'all. It's your time to live. God has closed the door on a certain light and barred you from it. You will constantly be spiritually guided away to anything that is not of your alignment. You don't protect yourself, you are protected. And now you understand. I'm hearing anything outside of your alignment will be clocked. So, uh, listen. Congratulations to being in this energy. To being in this space. For those of you who know how difficult Congratulations. Your old life is no more, so, you know, don't even, don't even bother. This is the truth. Let's read this. Fortune's wheel, luck and right timing. Luck and right timing, a turn of fortune. The fortune's wheel is a sign that luck has found the right timing in your life. 
you have the magic touch and everything turns to gold. You only need to hold what you desire as your intention and it becomes true. Do not waste this power on trifling things. Dream big, for surely this opportune moment will pass. Such is the nature of fortune's wheel. Use the creative power of the fortune's wheel for the benefit of others and the gifts will be returned to you tenfold. Use it only for your own gain and you will be left impoverished and with the bitter taste of squandered opportunity. Fortune's wheel comes unannounced. Notice the early signs, the coincidental encounters, and the seemingly magical and synchronistic events that herald its arrival. That call, that email, that invitation, that chance encounter was no accident. They were all choreographed by fortune. Do not wait any longer. Carpe diem, recall your boldest and noblest longing and invite it into your life. This invitation is all that is required. I will speak to you all in the next one. Bye.